How's your weekend? You know, uh, just caught a movie with Kat. You guys agreed on a movie. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I wanted to see an art film, but Kat insisted on violence and car chases. <laughs> I, I, I was gonna call you when I got home. When's your flight? Tomorrow afternoon. 2.30. Uh, Y'all caffeined out, or can I get you another coffee? I have to finish packing. Sure. But I'll be at school tomorrow morning. Empty my locker and stuff. <sighs> Great. I'll see you then. What's your plan? Uh, slip in, slip out? I was gonna come find you. You should be heading out pretty soon. Fifteen minutes. My parents are picking me up outside. Don't you feel like coming to the airport with us? No, it doesn't make any sense, does it? You'd have no way to get back. But there's the airport bus. Besides, I'm not so good at long, drawn-out goodbyes. Sure, then it's uh, better that way. I saw a story on the news the other night. Two high school sweethearts. They uh, moved apart, got married to other people, lived entire lives. Then they met all over again at a reunion. Yeah. They're both grandparents, and they're getting married. There's a plan. <laughs> Things will work out. We just gotta wait 50 years. This is really tough on you, isn't it? Moving 5,000 miles away, starting all over again. Yeah. Anytime you need someone to talk to. When you get a phone call at 3 in the morning, you'll know who it is. I'm really gonna miss you. Oh, Laurel, I'm so glad I ran into you before you left. Right. Um, I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I want you to know that it wasn't entirely your fault. And I have a lot of respect for you as a person. I already voted for Shannon. Have a nice life! Hi. Sure. <laughs> I went to the office and talked them into letting me vote in advance. They only let me do it once or he'd be president already. I'm really sorry things got weird between us. You didn't do anything wrong. You have my email address, right? Let me know as soon as you get hooked up in Houston. I'd really like to stay in touch. Same here. My parents are waiting. I'm really glad we talked. And I promise I'll send you my address. Sure. Who knows? Maybe I'll be back to visit. Or you'll be in Houston someday. <laughs> Stranger things have happened. I'll see you. He just left. What are you doing here? We got to the airport on time. They called our flight. And I realized I can't do this. <laughs> it was the most amazing scene right there in the departures lounge. My mom's yelling and I'm yelling and my dad's looking for a place to hide. And finally, I just left. <laughs> what, you mean your parents? As far as I know, they're on the plane. <laughs> so is all my luggage. I don't even have a toothbrush. <laughs> I love you. You better, because you're all I've got. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>